Well, praise the Lord. This is community activist Harry Traveling Shoes, Preacher Turner, special projects coordinated with the Birmingham Metro NAACP. Today, a very day that everyone should remember, that everyone should know about. And if you don't, then we want to take a minute today to let you know what happened. 1963, September, this day, four little girls, 16 sticks of dynamite, explosion at the 16th Street Baptist Church, and it took four little girls' lives. One surviving young lady, to this day, still present, going around, getting people to remember this infamous day. Now, here at the historic Kelly Ingram Park, I am joined with two individuals from Cincinnati. On the left of me, I have Joe Mullers. Joe Mullers. And Pat Mullers. And Pat Mullers, their husband and wife. Traveling shoes just in the middle of them so I can get them both on my, <laughs> my video here. It's a great day in America, okay? Hate tried to destroy us, hate tried to kill us, but today, guess what? Love brings us together. Brother Joe, you're here visiting from Cincinnati, Ohio. You heard about what happened, and this happened to be the day that you're in Alabama. Mm -hmm. What is that feeling like, or how could you express something to say to the media that's listening to us today? Well, I would just say that we should learn by our mistakes, and uh, we have a lot of things still to work on, but if, if love can do a lot, move mountains, we should try it. Hey, if love can move mountains, we could try it. Now, his lovely wife over here to the right She's of me. She's the better of the two. And, and she is the better of the two. So, hey, we're going we're gonna to give her the full time. Take all the time you need and just let her know. Give, give us your name again and then just tell the people what it's like being here in Birmingham, Alabama. Uh, my name is Pat Mullers, and I'm from Cincinnati, you just said. And I, we were both in high school when this occurred. And, and really was kind of a changing point in our lives, too. We both became involved in civil rights at the time. This is our very first trip to Alabama, and we're headed to Gulf Shores. But we noticed as we read the travel book that today was the day when this unfortunate event happened with four, four children. We now have four grandchildren of our own. So Amen. Even more so feel the pain of those families. So we're hopeful that things in our country continue to change. It's been a slow process. But with people like you and a lot of support I see, a lot of people going into the church across the street, we're hoping for better times for all those in this country, both black and white, as well as this family. Hey man, let, let me take this opportunity and thank both of them. Get back in here with me now, okay? <laughs> Y'all make me look good. All right, I want to thank both of them because they didn't have to stop. They didn't have to accept my invitation to even speak to you today. Black and white here together. This is what the whole fight was all about people coming together and we have a long way to go but we've come a long way and that's what we're going to start on today not only are we remembering those four little girls but we also remembering two young boys that was killed also in that same day johnny robinson and virgil ware so the outcast voters league today laid a wreath for the four little girls and also honored those two young men so i want to say to you if you're listening to us today and you have no idea what's going on. You've only heard about it. You've only watched it on television. And maybe you said, Traveling Shoes Preacher, listening to you today, I was not there 50-something years ago. I wasn't able to stop angry dogs from biting innocent people. Maybe I wasn't there 50 years ago to go to jails and unlock jail cells that had just imprisoned innocent people. Or, or maybe Traveling Shoes, I wasn't there 50 years ago to stop fire hoses that were being used illegally for the purposes that they wasn't intended for, but to punish people that were innocent. Maybe traveling shoes, I wasn't there 50 years ago to go and designate that bomb so that at 1022, it wouldn't have exploded and took the lives of those four little girls. But I want to do something. Well, I want you to do, I want you to love. That's what I want you to do. Matter of fact, two things every day. Love everybody and forgive everybody. Once again, Community Access Harry Traveling Shoes Turner coming from historic 16th Street Baptist Church, Kellyingham Park, Birmingham Civil Rights Institute, joined by my friends from Cincinnati, Ohio. We want to say God bless all of you. Continue to love and continue to peace. Any final closing remarks? Amen. 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 God bless you. Have a great day.